So in this video, I'll be showing you how to add a dual clock widget to the home screen of your Samsung Galaxy A06. So the first step is to access the home screen editor. And to do this, you want to long press on an empty space on your home screen. And then from here, you want to select widgets. Under widgets, you want to look for the section labeled clock and tap on it to view the different clock styles that you can use. Scroll down and look for your dual clock widget and tap on it and select add. From here, you should see your dual clock widget has been added to your home screen. So now to move it around, just long press on that widget and then drag it to wherever it is you want on your screen. You can even move it across home pages so you can move it like this across the border so that you can move it across the different pages that you have added onto your phone. To further customize it, you can always change the colors as well as the cities that are being shown. So to do that, you want to long press on the widget again, and then you want to select settings. Under settings, you should see first city and second city. So to change them, select either city. So let's select first city. And then from here, you can now choose your city. So you can choose to zoom out of this globe and look for your specific city or you can use the search function and you'll be taken to that city. So once you've selected your city, you want to tap on change. Now your first city has been switched to that one you've just selected. Again, you can apply the same, uh, the same instructions for the second city. So once you've changed the first and second city, then you should also see you also have the option to change the color. So currently, my door clock is set to day and night colors, which means depending on the city, it will show either white and orange and yellow for day or black and blue for night. So it's up to you to decide if you want to leave that enabled or you want to disable it. If you choose to disable it, then you can always select one color for the whole widget. So you can choose white or black, as well as increase or decrease the opacity and have it match with the dark mode. And so once you're done with the customizations, you want to tap on save to apply the changes. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions or comments, leave them down below and we'll get back to you.